Greetings and salutations. Welcome to the next installment of Someday You Return. Um, the psychological horror game that is um, relatively new. And so uh, we just got done in the previous episode running around pretty much with the head cut off after some crazy uh, beast chased us through the forest. And um, the trail, pretty much the path that they put us on led us to come back inside this place where he just got knocked out i think in part one and they took his phone but uh somehow his phone was returned to him and we are here so yeah welcome and um yeah let's get on what is this okay look like a flare yeah, and there was some creepy doll flashing inside of there. Hmm. There's definitely more than meets the eye right now. But I can tell you this game is pretty darn quiet. That's for sure. Okay, so this area is thoroughly explored go up to here that's a dead end there dead no oh, not quite a dead end hmm and this basement is huge yeah this almost seems like it's a old bunker of a sort bomb shelter even this hallway it wasn't here last night no, my friend, it was not. It was not here last night. Yeah, sorry, just trying to adjust my mic because I wanted to... The game is so quiet, so I'm turning my mic down. Um, yeah, because I have the volume all the way up on the game, so... Sorry, getting distracted here. Here, clock someone is leading me guess I'll soon discover why okay that's creepy and look way down there yeah this thing is huge There was something flickering down there at the end on the wall. I don't know why. Um. That sounds awesome. Oh, what a stench! Wow, what on earth, man? Body hanging up. <laughs> wow. Yeah, body hanging upside down. What on earth is this thing? Okay, we have to watch. Whoa, okay. What the hell? Fast. Get out of here fast, yes. We are out of here, man. Rebar is growing up on us. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. Out of here. You're good, you're good. Mm -hmm. 
Um, we have no healing agents or anything like that. My head is spinning. What on earth is this? Almost, almost there. Woof. Lots of candles. Made it to the front door. Oh, I've, I've got to get out of here. Where am I? Am I inside the chapel? I can't remember. How did I get in here? Shit, my head. Oh. It's hard to see through all this blood. First I should do something about it. Oh, this guy is jacked. He's barely moving. Who who's there? I should probably I should probably stop the bleeding first. Okay. I should probably I should probably stop the bleeding first. Well, all right, let's open up our inventory. I need something sharper. I hope they won't mind. The bleeding stopped, but I still feel like shit. I must have been poisoned down there. Hmm. Let's go ahead and grab these, what look like tinctures. I'm guessing he's going to start putting together his own, like, healing things. Oh. Could this be an antidote? It's definitely worth checking. Uh, dear, looks like Jarena. Despite my beliefs, I have to thank you for the recipe. The black materia of darkness must have been created by the devil himself. One mixed the herbs from our garden, and one no longer feel any influence of that evil substance on me. My sight is now clear, and I can now, or no longer, hear any whispering. Please come and take back your equipment. I left it on the shelf, together with your book and the recipes. We had our differences in the past, but I believe, now more than ever, that in our hearts you are a good woman. Please don't turn your back on our church anymore, and I promise not to warn our war. I guess that's warn my dis diocese against you and your. Okay. Let's see what this one is. Mm, definitely need to. That one's in case you'd. Have a hard time finding the right herbs this is an old recipe which heightens your senses and lets you smell them from afar drink this potion and the scent of each herb turns into a particular color i've marked the colors in my herbalism book so pay close attention to them to prepare the potion you need to boil crushed bachelor button petals add a single crushed leaf of silverweed Put in a lungwort's petal. Add two crushed roots from licorice. Drink one flask and the effect should be permanent. Jarena. Wow, so we are seriously going to be doing like um, some herbal Maybe stuff. Maybe something in there could help me. Herborium. You know, and it's too funny because I'm... Um, what an unusual box. Yeah, just take that stuff, dude. Take it, take it. But, um, yeah, I'm also doing a series on, um, A Plague's Tale, which is pretty big in herbalism as well. Matter of fact, um, I'm on a quest right now in A Plague's Tale to save her little brother's life by practicing herbalism. Hmm. 
So let's take a look at this book stuff. What is this? Mayday. Damn, batteries must be dead. Hmm. Oh, okay, this is the letter that she wrote. Black spit? What the hell? The symptoms sound very familiar, though. Hmm, purification. When your body gets corrupted by the black spit, nausea overcomes you and you'll hear voices calling out to you. Never follow them or they'll lead you into peril. Gather fresh herbs instead and prepare the following purif purifying potion. Put crushed puntanella root in boiling water mixed with pulmonera petals. Finally, put in two plantago leaves. Let it boil for a few minutes and drink a single cup to purify the darkness from your body and mind. Yeah, the whatever the whispers coming from that mist, we'll call it. Sound almost like her daughter Stella. So I'm guessing we gotta go outside and collect some herbs. You know, the crazy thing, and welcome to chapter three, by the way. What is this, dude? I need to get the poison out of my system. Okay, we know where the herb garden is. I think it was this over here. Wow, this is all different. There's the cross. Oh, and this must have been the original cathedral or church with Pope Clementine. Yeah, and see, and there's this, this thing down there, which was weird. Yeah, and I just assumed this was part of the herb garden here. I guess we gotta follow the creepy creature that was out there. Wherever he was standing. something yes he does hmm and I wonder if it's in the church all these stairs down a little bit what is this guy man Fresh snowflakes again? Somebody's trying to keep this place alive. Yeah. Definitely can't hurt, right? Refreshing. I like clean hands. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to follow that, like, ghost guy or whatever. Uh, let me see if we can find something in here to open up that door back there. Nope, nope, nope. Voila. Did not see that underneath the note. 
Let's go see if that will go to... We're not listening to you. Even though, like I said, that sounds like her, his daughter, Stella. Oh, okay. Let's see if this key works now. Thank you. I'm hoping that the herbs that we need to collect are somewhere back here. Hmm. What was the point of getting this unlocked? Hmm, do we have to get water back in here? So the plants will grow? I don't know. tell you this blurry stuff though is definitely making uh, life a little difficult oh yeah that was funny um it was sitting on top of the air conditioners and you couldn't find them because your masks were sitting on top of those yeah. i knew i brought them in yeah you did at least i mean now you know where they are they're not out in the wild somewhere True. Oh, okay. Have fun with that. Yeah. Hmm. Let's go check this trail sign. Maybe this trail sign actually has um, updated and has a like a herbal. Mm. It does not. the herbal book it says that I should study it to learn what items I have maybe this could help my vertigo on the bridge apparently I'm not the only one having problems here hmm okay we were already checked that ah, I can make this herbalist kit I just have to find all the parts Hmm. Stove. Dear reader, to use the use of herbs is probably as old as humankind medicine, as well as the arts of magic and witchcraft. Treat herbs and some fungi as gifts from Mother Nature. She cares about us and gives us just enough to survive and evolve. Over the years, it had been necessary to study them. An exceptional detail to discriminate the kinds for special purposes. Some of them can heal, some of them can kill. If you want to accept this gift, you should treat it with respect and knowledge. Always be careful when repairing potions and tinctures. Have your plants clearly labeled and respect the parts needed for each recipe. We recommend building a herbalism workbench to avoid any risk caused by careless handling of the potions. We entrust you hereby with wisdom needed to help others and wish you good luck on your path to enlightenment. Hmm. Magdragoria. Officinarium. <laughs> Is there 
Perinthium perithonium. Wow. I see blue, red, yellow, orange. Holy mackinoli, man. This kind of goes in depth. Wow, 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 wow. Uh, tutorial, conceptual items. Sometimes then he knows what to do, but has to assemble his idea from multiple items. You can see his idea visualized as blue transparent blueprints. You can insert items from your inventory into their correct places as shown, but his idea by his ideal blueprint. Your progress is tracked by the completion meter. Top right, telling you how much work still needs to be done. Wow. That is crazy. Okay. Mm, we do have the pot. And we don't quite know what one that one is. I thought that was the cutting board. Let's see. I'm sure they're making this much easier, much easier to assemble than, uh, rotate this. There we go. Now I can heat up water without risking a forest fire. If I'd known I'd be here this long, I'd have brought my camping gear. This looks right to me. You've just built an herbalist kit. Now you can make potions according to recipes you'll find on your journey. First, you have to gather all the herbs you need. They will appear in your herbalist book. Then step by step, follow the recipes on the left to add correct herbs on their parts in the right order in the pot. Holy mackinoli, Andy. You can obtain herbal parts by cutting them on the cutting board. You can further crush the parts and a mortar if the recipe asks for that. If you follow the process correctly, you will obtain a new potion, which will be stored in your potion inventory. And I'm sorry for the background noise. It's a brutally hot day today, and that is the AC, unfortunately. Yeah, my computer actually gets it roasting hot in um, the studio, put it that way. Uh, remember that the number of herbs in their parts is limited, as well as the number of potions you can carry at the time. Let's go, go collect some herbs. Lungwort. Bingo, this is what we were kind of looking for. Noise. See if some of those light up here. We're foraging now. Oh, I'm capped. Wonder if they grow back so you can reharvest these and replenish your potions. Yoink, we got the grish. I don't know, I'll go ahead and just make it right here. So we have to crush. <laughs> this is going to be what a learning experience. So we can place the devil's eyelash in water. We have that. Oh, I see. There we go. Okay. We'll get it down. First run through. And then we need licorice root. Licorice root to here. Oh, wow. Check this out. This is pretty cool. Leaves, petals. 
Why can't you put it in the mortar and pestle? Oh, okay. So there's like three pieces to the flower. Or we'll get it, we'll get it. Uh, then add fresh bachelor buttons. Oh man, we gotta go out and get more bachelor buttons. Hmm, this isn't gonna be easy. Yeah, we're out of bachelor buttons. Okay, that's cool. Let's go ahead and... Or we'll replenish our stores. We got halfway through on the first run through on it, so that's not bad. Bachelor buttons. There we go. Oh, and that's nice that it still holds it there. I thought we were going to have to start all over again. Two. Okay. Oh, and their bachelor button leaves. Then finally, crush some urbane root and add to the mix. Noise. We made our first potion. That's legit. Drink calm mine. I'm waiting for the effects, man. Flower sense. Okay. When your body gets corrupted by black spittle, nausea will overcome you and you will hear voices. Okay, drink this potion to purify your body. We have silver weed. But crushed silver weed root. Alright, I think actually getting the hang of this now. Then we have to the radix thing was mess me up um put crushed silver weed root into boiling water okay so let's crush that put that in there um lung wart mixed lung wart petals so we got to cut that make some petals finally put in two buckhorn leaves we gotta chop that guy. And we need two. I'll put one. And dos. <laughs> ah, it's disgusting. <laughs> oh, what happened here, man? <clears throat> Feels like the potions working thank god oh man that blew me away straight again that's pretty cool that is actually a neat mechanic that they added to the game that's you know definitely most i have to find a way to the camp hopefully stella is still there i've lost too much time already 
Yeah, we'll have to grab some more supplies. Definitely take that stuff with us. But yeah, that is crazy. Um, I was just saying uh, that's a pretty cool mechanic that they added to the game that, uh, you know, most of these genre of games don't have that kind of mechanic to it. So that is pretty cool. But we are going to take a pause for the cause right here. We're obviously all better now. We did some herbalism work. Um, figured out how to make some potions. And uh, now we can get back onto the main story. And try to find Stella. Um, when, when we come back. Um, yeah, we'll restore our wares. Actually, I'll restore these offline. I'll have a full load of this stuff. Um when we start up the next episode and get back onto the main story so until then my friends we're just going to cut it right here i uh, appreciate the support on the channel you guys have been awesome and uh man yeah until next time i will catch you on the other side peace